truth universally acknowledged that every now and again a situation arises that defies explanation. And so it was with the ascension of the Third Street Saints. When the Saints made their presence known to the world in 2006, they were decried for being pretenders to the throne. The people were confused. Were the Saints sociopathic killing machines hell-bent on destruction? Or puckish rogues living a life of mirth and whimsy? The Saints needed clarity of purpose. And being a setup. It's not a setup. The intel is good. You trust this lady? Asha's one of the good guys. Only knows her from the KGB days. Oh, she's tied with the KGB. I feel a lot better. Look, Bert and I work with her too. She's fine. Oh yeah, I'm sure she's great at putting someone in a fucking body bag. That doesn't mean we should... behind schedule we need to move you're a real people person aren't you i'm sorry is this a counter-terrorist operation or a saint's flow shoot i'm shy asher odakar follow me business we know what's at stake do you look lady this motherfucker knows how to get shit done don't you worry about me what's security my tech guy bought us a 10 minute window if we move fast we'll only need to worry about the guards on foot how many of those are there don't know about the numbers inside but there are about eight marching the perimeter on my signal we is not really our thing. Come on, this way. Base, are you there? What are we walking into? I'm looking at suggest. Hold on. Hide. Truck on its way. Wait a minute. Your hammer is. Was that Matt Miller? Kinsey, be nice. Seriously. Matt Miller is a brilliant attacker, a venerated agent of MI6, and a key member of our operation. And the fact that he tried to kill us. What's past is past. We are all working together now. Let's focus on the job. As I was saying. Hold that thought, Matt. Guards ahead. Saying. The nuke is stashed deep in the compound. It's likely primed and ready to go. Getting booted from the U.S. sent Cyrus Temple off the deep end, but teaming up with terrorists? Seriously? And we're in. Get my back. You should be nearing the 
missile. Cyrus has seriously lost. has its bumps. Bump? You call that a bump? You're alive, aren't you? Me. You two go through that door. On. Let's see how you can handle yourself, Mr. Celebrity. We'll be on mic. Handle myself? Shit. I can handle myself. You should be really close to the missile silo now. Stay alert. Cyrus is such a burke when it comes to security. No sign of the target, but we're looking at a stockpile of explosives and chemicals here. I can't tell what kind. Chemicals, lady. What else you need to know? Yo, we're here. The target is just ahead. Target's in the next room. Damn it!
You saw me as more than that. We snap at each other sometimes, and I don't always understand your methods. But there's no one I'd rather follow into battle. You said, hey, Piz, how would you like to be the face of the saints? And I was all, I, I, oh, man. yourself to save the world. I suppose I wouldn't have tried to kill you. Well, we just met, but, um, uh, you seem to know. Nice. The war has disabled, but it's still moving fast. This is a problem. It's not a problem. You alienated part of America. I alienated crazy people. You couldn't resist, could you? Jesus, not you two. This is a problem. I keep trying to explain that, but the president won't listen. Poverty is a problem. Apartheid is a problem. This, this is just a couple of... Here's the latest approval poll. We lost 20 points. We can get them back. They're at 20 points. I'll admit that's a little lower than anticipated. So you agree you have a problem? Nope, you do. You're the communications director. Fix this. Can you give me 100% employment? No. Will you get married? Fuck no. Then I'll get you in trouble. King, can you have this naysayer assassinated? Not when you say it publicly. I'm more fun as a gang leader. We have a country to run. Fun isn't part of the equation. Who's a septic truck when you need one? Come on, Keith, have some good news. Jesus, he schedules a press conference for this early in the morning. Listen, we've got enough clout right now for one major bill, not both. What do you want me to push forward? Do you want to be the president who cured cancer or the president who solved the world hunger? Speaking of hunger, uh, tell the kitchen to send up a burger. Good choice. I hope Kenzie's keeping the sharks at bay. Now, you listen here. If you think you can cram your agenda past Congress, you are in for a rude awakening. You hear me? Now, let me tell you a little something about the greatest word in politics. Filibuster. Allow me to retort! Hey, Doris, we still down for tennis? Oleg and I are about to head over to Camp David to watch some Nightblade. Yep. You down? Boom! It saved me some popcorn this time. I'm your number one fan! Nice work, Oleg. <sighs> the president's words were taken out of context. Kinsey, what's the right context for, and I quote, I'm the patron saint of America. We should probably look into changing the Pledge of Allegiance to one nation under me. That's a great question. Jane? 
I think we have a problem. No, not you two. How many times do I have Asha to... Asha and Miller are waiting for you in the Oval Office. If MI6 needed something, they would send it up the chain, not fly across an ocean. They said nobody back home believes them. Jesus, what's going on? They think we're about to be attacked by aliens. I gotta go. This is serious. You know that Kinsey's been saying the same thing. When did you start taking Kinsey seriously? When the people who helped us save the world said we should. All right, I'll swing by after I... Salvation within the Zin Empire. I'm smarter than all these people. Delightful. Kenzie, no! <laughs> <laughs> 